Now let's go over to Maggie. Harry, thank you. There are a lot of ways to help the environment by going green. And one way is with eco-friendly laundry products. Joining us right now is Jessica Zerman, associate editor of Plenty magazine. And Jessica, you brought plenty of good examples. Good morning. Good morning. Let's talk about green detergent. You're seeing them pop up so much more than ever in grocery stores. Yeah, green detergents, there are so many alternatives now to conventional detergents, which are toxic, bad for your health, bad for the environment. There are four things, really, that you should look for. Full disclosure, companies aren't required by law to list their ingredients, but you should be wary of those that don't. Fragrance-free, a lot of the fragrances used to make these synthetic detergents smell so great are petrochemicals, phthalates, which are hormone disruptors and can irritate the skin and eyes. Concentrated, you mm -hmm. want a formula that's, if ours are all two to three times more concentrated than regular, reduces packaging. Less is more. Less is more. And finally, do they work as well in cold water as they do in hot water? Because washing your clothes in cold water saves 90% of your energy. So how do you know? Can you give us a little help deciding? Sure. Well, we have four here. Um, actually, this is Ecos, which is great for people with sensitive skin. Okay. It's a really pure formula, and one ounce will wash a full load of laundry. Gotta love that. All right, are we doing a test? We here? are. What do you this want to show? Is, so these are um, eco stain removers. This is a shout, and this is the naturally clean biodegradable wipe. Okay. This will dissolve the stain on contact. So maybe you'll do that one and I'll do sure. this one. Let's see which one's better. And really, this is one of the stain removers that you want to pre-treat. Um, yeah. What, what is this, coffee? Yeah. Freshly spilled coffee. Okay. That comes Just in pretty handy. much how my morning goes exactly. this day. So. Okay, so yours is working much more efficiently and, fa and faster. This is the shout. It's got a lot of chemicals in it, so it's going to work better immediately. But this, if you leave it on, we did one earlier, and it actually, yeah, there we go. It on, yeah, it'll completely dissolve the stain. Maybe it takes a little longer, but does the job. It does the job. And better for the environment. And better for the environment. All right, very good. And now fabric softener. Do you even really need it? Well, you know, a lot of the detergents, like the Arm & Hammer detergent has fabric softener built in. It's a soy-based softener. Some people think you need it, some people don't, but we have great eco options that work just as well as the conventional. I mean, can you feel the difference? Yeah. This is the Ecover fabric softener. You just throw it in at the last rinse cycle. They're both great. And, um, you know, when it washes down the drain, you don't have to worry about it. Getting into drinking water, getting in and disturbing aquatic life. It's just a better alternative. So just like with the fabric softeners and the detergents, are there certain established green brands already that meet the criteria that you told us? There are. I mean, Seventh Generation is a great brand. They're a master as far as full disclosure. Ecover is a new brand that is just working wonders. People love Ecos. Plenty loves Arm & Hammer's new Essentials line. It's a company that's tried and tested, been around forever, and really works. All right, Jessica, thank you so much. Thank you so much, Maggie. Appreciate it. If you want more on green detergents or other products for your laundry, just go to our website, earlyshow.cbsnews.com. I love this old, what's old is new again. Yeah. My mother hung the wash behind our house back when I was a kid, and now it's all the rage. It's good for the environment. That's <laughs> what all the kids are doing. It smells so clean. <laughs> yeah. Hey, by the way, uh, that, uh, that Helen Thomas documentary. Yeah. Monday night, 9 p.m. on HBO. HBO, there you go. Have a great Watch day, the everybody. Saturday night show. Bye. Tomorrow, I'm Jack Black.